Hey guys, thank you for listening here. Uh, we'll talk about a ASFL and about the Amazon Floristo and the company announces completion of publication of its pending disclosure to the OTC market. What does that even mean? It means that the uh, natural resources have an in innovative sustainable um, and management for resources and capital cr uh, credits actually. So in this article they published actually <clears throat> yesterday, uh, they're talking about the updates of what you know their requirements to the OTC and all the, the, the uh, documents that sent sent through. And on um, paragraph two it says uh, they're being interviewed this week on uh, uh, PCAOB audit, basically audit firms for um, to to audit the company. And they're gonna so you know their financial statements and all that stuff that they 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 need an audited um, uh, company. For, for requirements and also it says here i'll read it straight off the um the quote from ricardo it look it took a little longer than expected completed nine reports but they have been filed as promised to our shareholders management to asxl space ltc will accept the report and remove all warrants posted on our ticket in the coming days recurrent uh, returning to our compliance and been priority since december and now it is a close to reality once the stop sign is removed from the co um, company we'll move forward towards a p COCB audits and seek and become a fully reported for the SEC later this year and perhaps apply to the OTC or QB or OK OK or KX. We expect to, to have all soon all the necessary components and requirements and very promising exciting for the XFL and our shareholders. Basically, he's trying to say that he, he has all the documents being submitted and they're still waiting for approval. And that's he, he did some approve it, but they do take time, right? So, meaning that if you go on the SEC, um, website and um actually go and take, take a look at what they have submitted uh you know they they also they, they do a notice of late filing like i don't understand why they do that so and in, in in a way where it's if they're in time and you have a document just submit it right and right now since they don't have a lot of operations then it's so simple but they still do it i don't know why but that's one of my downfalls with this company and also <clears throat> on the um on the on the Basically, on the article, it states that they're going to also go to Colombia. They have a Colombia partnership that will also be disclosed licenses that already has operated production and storage facility under license under the Colombian government. So they're going to Colombia, also in Mexico and Colombia, so they can get product and goods at a, at a cheaper rate. And that's good. And so they are they're they're they are thinking on the right path. They just need to put everything together and execute. So it's all about execution and execution rates and getting this. Uh, you know, done. That's the that's the risk here. So it's good. It, it it's getting there. It's it step by step, day by day, and we see the stock right here at point zero zero seven one down four percent. Um, from yesterday's run at all to point zero zero eight. So there's there's a lot of momentum in the stock <clears throat> on the. So um, for my purposes is only it's just for entertainment. I think that for me to get in the stock has to be a little bit more established, more things already concrete because Mexico still hasn't passed their law and Colombia, I'm not too sure about Colombia law, but still like, um, so there's still a little bit iffy questions there to turn, uh, uh, basically, uh, an idea to a business. And that's where we're going to from an idea to a business. So. I'm still waiting for it to so I could pop up more. I, I'm in it, but I want too many shares. But to make a big position, to get a bigger, bigger position, I need to have more establishments on what really is going on to turn money and profit that will turn this stock into a dollar stock. So that's my opinion on this stock. But still, it is very promising, very good news. And hopefully, you found this video very, um, have some value to your analysis. and. If you do like it, please subscribe to my channel. Thank you for listening. Until next time.